Hi guys, today I will tell you about the Open Refine tool. It is a data manipulation tool which cleans, reshapes and intelligently edit batch, messy and unstructured data. It is an open source tool and you can download it from the internet and can use it freely. Uh, today, now I am going to teach you, uh, I will tell you how you will create a project in the Open Refine. Uh, first, you need to click the EXE of Open Define. Then it will open a window in the browser like this. Then you then you need to click on the Choose File option. You you will select a file, the data set which you want to upload it. I'm uploading this Excel sheet. Then click on the Next button. It will upload the data of your Excel sheet and you can rename it like I am renaming this project as faceting and then you can click on the button create project. Now I will tell you about the feature uh, faceting of Open Define. It is a method to filter data into subsets for easy use. It can be done for text, number and dates. Uh, firstly, I will tell you about the text facet feature uh, which will group the same set of data in groups and it will show the number of rows for each data. Now I will apply text facet on column state. Click on uh, the drop down menu of state and select text facet. On the left panel, uh, you can see that it has grouped the same data into the groups like for California you can click on the but, uh, California tab and it is showing that it has 42 number of records uh, also like you can see below that there are similar data for state Cali CA California these all uh, groups are belong to the same uh, family of state California and you can edit these to merge all these groups into one like click on the edit button and you can write CA and apply you can see that it has merged into this and the number of rows for ha it has increased to 46 same for this California another one CA California CA uh, again renaming it to CA California CA in not in caps so I have renamed all the California uh, data into one group CA and it is showing now 73 rows for the state CA and you can see that it has structured the data in a good manner also you can uh, you can see button count on the upper panel and it will show the maximum number of rows for the biggest group like here the state California has the maximum number of rows and, is, and it is being shown at the top. Now I will tell you about the custom text facet. Uh, custom text facet, it, it will, you can edit the number of, you can edit the data to, uh, in the column. Like click on the facet and select custom text facet it will open a new window now you need to write value dot split brackets zero now you can see, see that it is splitting the data of the like first name of the countries and click ok Now in the left panel below you can see that it has grouped the data according to the first name of the cities. Also you can make any number of uh, text facets on any number of columns. You can reset all to move back to the original. Now I will tell you about the numerical facets. It will rearrange the uh, number into numerical bins. You can find it 
at the end you can see that it has it is showing the data in the numerical range panes and you can select any range for easy usage of the numbers so this is the text uh, faceting option which i have taught you thank you